10 Reasons Why Hiking Is Good For You Hello Travelers! Welcome to Economy Tour 360, the place where you get all travel and budget information. If you are new here, please press the subscribe button. Before going to the 10 reason of hiking, let's look at the difference between walking and hiking. Hiking and walking are quite similar but have a definite difference. You see, with walking, you are merely putting one foot in front of the other and covering some distance. You could be walking from your couch to the fridge or from the office to your house. Experts have proven that walking has considerable health benefits, including boosting your self-esteem, decreasing depression tendencies, and helping to fight off sicknesses. It's important to note that walking takes place mostly on flat and plain grounds with minimal obstacles. Hiking, on the other hand, is merely walking but on more mountainous terrains. It involves walking from low altitudes to high altitudes. Usually, it means more energy than walking depending on the terrain you choose. Hiking will get your heart beating faster than walking. Also, when hiking, you'll need to invest in some special equipment to keep you comfortable throughout the journey. Let's go back to the 10 reason why hiking is important for health. Number 1. It improves your overall health. Laziness and physical inactivity are often linked to numerous health problems, including osteoporosis, obesity, diabetes, coronary heart disease, and some types of cancer. But here's the good news. Being physically active can help prevent most of these diseases and prevent premature death. Since hiking keeps you active, it improves your overall health, have you live longer and experience a quality life. Number 2. Lowers your risk of cardiovascular disease As we mentioned before, hiking will get your heart beating faster and blood coursing through your body swiftly. You can consider this as exercising the cardiovascular system. Hiking regularly can help to increase high-density lipoproteins and reduce the triglyceride levels in the body. Readjustments of these levels will help to reduce your chances of developing heart-related diseases and stroke. Number 3. Improve your blood pressure and blood sugar levels Yes, you don't have to pop some pills to keep your blood pressure in check. All you need to do is to go hiking. Here's what happens. When you hike regularly, your heart gets stronger. This means that it will pump more blood with minimal effort. When this happens, the force exerted on the arteries decreases, and consequently, your blood pressure reduces. In addition to this, hiking will help in controlling blood sugar levels. Patients with type 2 diabetes have high glucose levels in the bloodstream. This is usually because the body doesn't produce sufficient insulin to break it down, or the body is insulin resistant. Whichever the case, hiking can help in reducing blood sugar levels. Number 4. Increases your energy levels Now, if you have never gone hiking before, you probably are thinking of how tired you'll get afterwards. The thought of the fatigue that follows is enough to keep you cooped up in your house. But this thinking is wrong. It's just the body tricking you into being lazy. Contrary to what many people believe, exercising will not make you tired. Instead, it will gradually increase your energy and make you stronger with time. The changes occur at a cellular level. The human cells have tiny powerhouses known as mitochondria, which are tasked with the responsibility of producing energy. While it's true that your diet affects your energy levels, it's also true that the number of mitochondria you have is affected by how active you are. Hiking will help trigger the cells to make more mitochondria and in the end, produce more energy. Number 5. Burns calories. Fat stores energy that the body needs during physical activities. Hiking will cause your body to tap into these energy reserves to burn calories. The number of calories burned will depend on how much hiking you do. But generally, a man who weighs 154 pounds and is 5'10", will burn about 370 calories during a 1-hour hiking session, or 185 calories during a 30-minute hiking session. Number 6. Increases your bone density Believe it or not, your bones are alive. You can think of them as tissues. Hiking regularly triggers the formation of new bone tissue and strengthens them. Like muscles, bone tissue also responds to progressive overload and stress. When you periodically exert pressure on the bone, the body responds by enhancing and adding to its density, enabling it to withstand the overload. Hiking will exert direct pressure to the bone, and the above results will be experienced in a short while. Moreover, arthritis is alleviated as your joints become more fluid. Number 7. Improves balance. Most youngsters don't appreciate the importance of developing their balance. Balance becomes more and more critical as you age. The elderly often suffer balance-related falls. 
When you are new to hiking, you'll notice that you'll often trip and have a hard time balancing on the rocky trails. But with time, you'll get the hang of it, and you'll be navigating uneven ground with the finesse and balance of a ballet dancer. Number 8. Lower risk of cancer hiking will help to reduce your risk of developing certain types of cancers, including lung, blood, colon, bladder, rectum, neck, head, kidney, and breast cancers. Additionally, hiking and being physically active can help improve the quality of life during cancer treatments. Number 9. Elevates your mood. After a hike, you'll notice that your moods will improve drastically. Even if you are feeling under the weather or are just having a bad day, going hiking will lift your spirits. What happens is that the body produces endorphins, which help in fighting mood swings, depression, and anxiety. Number 10. Alleviates insomnia. If you experience problems sleeping at night, rather than popping some sleeping pills, you should go hiking and make it a regular activity. Hiking will help you fall asleep faster and feel refreshed when you wake up. It achieves this by reducing your stress levels, which is the number one cause of insomnia. Once the stress is out of the picture, you fall asleep with ease and sleep like a baby. If you like this video, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching.